How? Oh, hi guys, welcome to season two of the official recovery channel. I'm Neil. I'm Paul. Uh, nah, yeah, it's a bit light hearted today. Um, yeah, so I'm just sitting here reminiscing. I've had a nice morning um, walking the dogs and the dangies. And I was thinking about this. I was just thinking how the woods have changed, so like different paths and that. And you get what I mean? Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. You, you're there every day, so you've obviously changed. You've obviously been in there. They might be building there, you know. Wouldn't surprise me. If you go up that hill. Yeah. There's, the mud, there's mud tracks. I went up there and he was, um, was walking the dogs and he was a tractor up there, fucking digging holes. Yeah. I went, what are you doing? He went to uh, test in the soil. I went, what for? He went, uh, contamination. Testing the soil to see if they can fucking build. Yeah, yeah, that's typical, isn't it? Do you know what I mean? Typical. Absolutely typical. Like, the, that's what we're talking about. Like, the amenities. You can't get a doctor's appointments. You can't get a dentist. And they're just building more houses. The shopping centre's 50 years old. It's fucking shite. No sports centre. Sports centre gone. Fire. Bats should be gone. Yeah. Oh. So like the town grows like population wise and the amenities just go down the networks just I don't know, I don't want to rant about that, but no, I was just thinking about how the woods haven't recovered if like trees have fell and that path up the hill. It was about the bears kids, was it? And the because it's the time of the year the waterfall is not too but like we've partied down there, don't we remember that? Uh, the waterfall's always flowing, mate. No, I'm saying it's because it's so bad it's not it's not overflowing, yeah. no one yeah, yeah. yeah. Only needs the rain now. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it'll go it flows. Yeah. That leads to the toilet, doesn't it? Yeah, it's part of the river system, mate. Yeah, yeah. Party down there, mate, back in the day. It's not man made. Yeah. No, I know that. I know that. That's, they're probably ain't they, the fucking council, because they, they, they want to build there, they yeah, build everywhere, don't build, they? Don't mm. That field on the side, I asked him what he was doing, he went, oh, oh, it's testing the soil, and I went, testing the soil for what? Contaminants, a fucking hill, yeah. in the middle of nowhere. Mm. Well, what's this space, you know what I mean? Because that, that wouldn't have That means it. they build them. Yeah. Yeah. You want to build. Fuck is yeah. So I can't remember if it was this year or it was season one or the start of season two, which didn't start, by the way. It's when I started out to park my channel. Um, but again, it's, 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 uh, it is what it is. I didn't have a choice. Well, I did have a choice. Yeah, yeah. I took the choice not to. And it was probably wise in a sense, you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, I'm sure what you've got to do. Yeah, yeah. So like, um, so how was your life? Just a snack show. Yeah, I can remember the last video we done. I can't remember if it was a year or six months ago. Give us a little sniff down. What's going on? Fuck all, mate. Same old, isn't it? Mm. Just plodding on. Eh? Your boys have got older, mate. We've got older. <laughs> I've matured. I'm like a fine cheese. Oh, yeah. <laughs> No, it's like it's cracked on, hasn't it? Yeah. No majors. That was a good way to describe yourself as a chief. <laughs> to go stale, to go off. So it's not mature, mate. I got pungent. Pungent. Yeah, pungent. <laughs> um, no, so yeah, so, so in the fact that there's no majors, is there? You know what I mean? No major fucking. Nah. Yeah. You shouldn't be, just be there. Yeah, yeah. but that's the sound of like something fucking okay, isn't it? Shouldn't be. Yeah, yeah, no, you fucking hope not. Um, yeah, so like, why the company spun? You know what I mean? Um, I haven't been away. I'm conscious of that you've been away recently. I mean, I know yeah. what I mean. It must be nice that with the family, mate. It's a dream of that. Yeah, it is nice. And I live for it, don't yeah, I? I don't go to pubs, do no, I? That's what I mean. You, you're conscious of it. People go to me, you know, he's away. And I go, you're always in the fucking pub. Yeah, yeah. Every weekend. Mm -hmm. I don't do that. Yeah. But that's what I mean. I'm going to book on next year's holiday. I'm saying it here. Yeah. But it's like, I'm probably not at the stage where my kids will be there. But it's to get in the habit of saving, of sticking to my word. I'm fucking having a good time, you know what I mean? Like putting my money into something. Listen, 
to me having a good time is like the weather, the scenery, and eating, yeah. and doing what you want, know what I mean? Yeah. It's like, obviously we've been away together millions of times, we? yeah, we, yeah. we've had mad ones. Yeah. But the last few, last time you come to Thailand, all we did was eat. Yeah. I got, I got wrecked a fair few did, days You did what you did. Yeah, yeah. But I had the kids, didn't I? Yeah, it was yeah. like, and we got ill. That, that was we were that ill. Was, yeah. But aside from that, what did we do? We had we a little flare with YouTube, didn't we? Remember yeah, that? Yeah, we, we did. We did work. Yeah, yeah. Come back. And we worked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We worked. Mm -hmm. I loved that all the you know. I'm just thinking because the boys were at an age where like we'd just been without getting into gory things. Yeah. Like, we'd been through trauma, hadn't we? And then. It was kind of like, it took us time to like fucking breathe, you know what yeah. I mean? It was healing had to be done. That was recovery in my opinion. Yeah. Oh, it is quite, listen, holidays are recovery. Yeah, yeah. To me, holidays are the must. Yeah, yeah. Again, it's whatever floats your boat. There's people who like going out every weekend. Yeah, there's people like that. That's, how, that's, how, that's how they let their hair down. Mm. That's what they did. They drink fucking four bottles of wine and fucking whatever. Yeah. Mm. That sound. Yeah. It's whatever floats your boat. Yeah. But me, I, I don't, I don't go out. I don't do them things. Yeah. Don't go to pubs. Don't fucking. I'd rather stay here. And fucking manifest me next holiday. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna come to manifest. That, 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 that's what I, I like to do. Yeah. I, it's. Do you know what I mean? I, I don't. I know I'm not missing out on fuck all. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I've been around the block. There's no. I'm gonna see everyone now. Yeah. The fucking half of them are like, you look at you like you're fucking special because you don't fucking do what they do every fucking. Yeah. People look ill, don't you? I don't mean everyone. I don't mean do. box everyone. Of course people having a boss. You better get your leg off my head. <laughs> Stop touching me there, you. So that's that type of job. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, of course they do. Yeah. Because it's prolonged, mate. Yeah. Once you want to get to our age, it's like, you, you get more, because when you start, I was, I class myself as a late starter, but the drunk alcoholically, like, pre before I say I started at 16. Yeah. But that's when, like, the shackles come off, where substances up, smoking started, drinking more regular, where that, like, Friday, maybe going out Friday, Saturday, went to, like, Thursday, Sunday. Yeah. Then before the new winter when and then it's just any days of yeah, yeah. day. We've all done that though. Yeah, but we? I class myself as a late starter, sixteen, but obviously once you get to forty fucking five, if you started at fourteen and sixteen matter, it's it irrelevant, it doesn't matter. Yeah. It's just it's like a lot of people may are just stuck, it's happy. Yeah. We've done it. Yeah, yeah. When you get paid, it's get fucking Get swatted, mm -hmm. and that's simply all it's about. And and it's surprising how many people who've done that for fucking 20, 30, 40 yeah. years. Decades, just, just the same thing. It's my there's, there's people at the there's people who do it even on their holidays, yeah. go the same place, yeah. and that's good. Oh, drinkers, yeah, yeah. Cause they get friendly with a barman, yeah. a local bar or yeah. whatever, it's and it's like, and they'll go out. back every year. Mm -hmm. I meet people on holiday like that, yeah. and I go, why would you come back here? <laughs> been here? Yeah. Why would you come back this hotel? Wasn't that good? Yeah. And I've been here. Because yeah, I like the new bit. It's, like the the new... it's nervous and exciting, isn't it? The new is what it's all yeah. about. Yeah. I couldn't imagine travelling abroad. To go back to the same hotel, <laughs> to see the same barman. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Mm. It's like, yeah. To yeah. me, that's insane. But then again, they 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 might think I'm insane because I don't fucking go out. Yeah. Oh, Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. I get loads of people say that to me. Wish I could be like you, fucking. Just don't go out then. <laughs> yeah, I have a plan. To yeah, go out. Yeah. I've, been, well, listen, I've be... been in the going out. I've yeah. been in the get paid, mate, hit the bank at 12 o'clock. Yeah. 
fucking ten past twelve, yeah. and we're out. I've been there. Yeah, let's explore that. No going out because I thought th that was the only way to have a good time. It was always associated because I might get a girl. You know what I mean? Mum was always used to bring a girl back. Yeah, that was yeah. it. That, that was the goal. And when I think about it, it's like the fucking I was never really asked about the social. And like, I get nervous when you're going in the... And it, that's what I realised. I was thinking about it. So I do the other night. Going out in... So you're going out in the unknown for a girl. But when you smash it, you get a girl. You have a laugh. You go home. You get lucky. You get up the next day and tell all the lads. So that unknown, when it goes well, yeah. is what I'm chasing. So I'm going out to the unknown. Hoping it's going to be boss, but then I turned 45, mate, 30 years and I haven't been boss. And I'm still hoping that that unknown, that, that unknown could happen. So I'll fucking tell myself a million times that that unknown, that this this time it's going to be it, you know what yeah, I mean? Nah. And uh, I'm alone in my large fucking spare room. The only, the only time is me myself. Going out doesn't do that for me. It doesn't it's simply it, yeah. fucking... In my younger days, it was like a horny dog. <laughs> yeah, and yeah. that's it. Yeah, yeah. The only times I've gone, took a breath and gone, wow, this is, <laughs> this is, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's when we've been away. Yeah, yeah. Thailand and that, yeah, in the middle of a I've fucking just, city. Yeah, in the middle of, you know what yeah. I mean? And I've just stopped for a minute. Cool. I've stopped yeah, for a minute yeah. and yeah. just looked around and went, yeah. And even then, you're not too intoxicated at that point, you know, when you're taking in the seat. You're We're never really fucking... intoxicated at all, like, that's what I'm starting to say. Yeah. Everyone always goes to me, you must have fucking... Yeah, he goes to Thailand and all that, and I'm like... The first time I went when I was younger, we got girls on the first night and stayed yeah. with them. Yeah. For a month. <laughs> eh? mm -hmm. So we didn't sleep with fucking... Yeah, yeah. Twenty. You know what I mean? We didn't do all kinds mm. and what people would imagine. Mm. And then the three times I've been since then, twice I've not even fucking been with any. You know what I mean? Yeah. And we, I'm listen. We go for a couple of months, don't we? Yeah. But I've never fucking been with no one on that. On the last time I went, I met a girl in a bar who run a bar. You know what I mean? Yeah. Spent had a couple of nights with her and that was it. Yeah. But um, everyone goes, yeah, no, nah, it's not, it's not like that. Yeah. I go there for the hospitality. Yeah. I go there. You're for... big on tipping. Uh, uh, I've learned loads and it don't, doesn't come naturally with what you do. I, cre I like the environment you create, but I get, I get vexed, you know what I mean? Little niggles get on me fucking boy. And it, and it, it always needs to be steaming off, spitting me dummy out. No, I like, I like them looking after me. Yeah, I know, I know. I like, I like them looking after me. I just don't want it to cost me more than what's on How I see menu. it is, you know, listen, well, I, because I, I, I... I'm not saying you're wrong, by the way, because I like what you do, but I just don't like... I live for the holiday. Yeah. So before I go on that holiday, I know in my head... X amount If we're there. in fucking Thailand for a month, I know that there's a grand in tips going out yeah. throughout that month. So it's it's accounted for before you go. Yeah. It's not. And you get the service, like. That's I get, what I'm I saying. Love the service. So it, it's smart. I don't add up, you know what I mean? I like what brings it. I'm just not prepared to fucking do it. For whatever reason, we can pull that apart fucking uh, the laser dice. Nah, but um, fucking good. That's the sort I want to speak about. Like, and it's something I don't mind talking about, you know what I mean? Because in early recovery, it fucking took me up the game. It's like sex, I've had to treat sex and like women as like drugs, like one is too many, a thousand not enough. And the early doors, I didn't think that, that was possible. I always thought, well, you know it, you say one course, but I'd say 12 months or the steps, or some people say two years, there'd always be where I could then you what I wanted, sexual wise. Yeah. Now, nah, now, nah, there's no time limit on it. After this whole time, I'm clear now, and part of the reason why I hope it comes across on the camera, I've got a semblance of fucking recovery about me now. Yeah. It's because I've treated it that way. I've not been wrapped up in emotions around girls. I love girls. I love yeah. interacting with girls. But like, that's the thing with sex, and imagine it applies to all addicts. I love, them, interwoven. I love them going home as well. <laughs> I never used to know that. I never wanted to do it. But it's all tied in, though, with my behaviours now I'm drinking drugs. So yeah. it's always like going out, 
drinking, drugging, sex. It's always like, and it's fucking. Yeah, crazy. it's a parcel, isn't it? Yeah, and <laughs> so where did I put it? I took the drugs out there because I didn't. Still wanted the girl. Still wanted me cake and eat it, and it didn't end very fucking well. Nah, mate. Listen, I don't know. Listen, some people learn, some people don't. Yeah, to understand. Mm. I can't even preach. I've been fucking burnt a couple of times. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? I can't, I can't, I can't. And now, a lot of people are go, well, that's not, you know, because now I'm like antsy, aren't I? I'm like, <laughs> I, I won't let nothing disturb me peace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And there's been a couple of girls who are nice. And I can't even let them in the door. Do you yeah. understand? You've got a bit the other way now. Yeah. And the other way, I've been yeah. single that long now yeah. and living in peace and fucking yeah. harmony. Yeah. Um, it's just not something I'm fucking after, mate. It's yeah. weird. Yeah. Obviously, there's at times you want fucking female company. It's yeah. not even not, not even female company sometimes, it's adult company. Mm. Um, obviously, single parents, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. But. Do you know what I like? When, when I think about what I've been through and what can fucking happen. Well, put it this way, I've never, no, no one will ever live with me again. Yeah, yeah. Ever. Ever. If I meet someone tomorrow, they've got their own house. They'll always have their own house. Yeah, they'll stay that way. They'll stay that way. Yeah. I don't give a fuck what happens, how fucking in love we become, whatever. Does it, it's irrelevant. Yeah. I don't believe in that. And anyone young and anyone in any situation, I'd suggest get your own gaff yeah. and keep your own fucking gaff. Yeah. Always. Always. I ate that as a young man. I didn't really get it, but I get it now, you know what I mean? Because it doesn't mean you don't love your bed or you don't spend this amount of time. You know what I mean? Mm. It doesn't, doesn't restrict nothing. Just don't, don't, don't ever give your own gaff up. Yeah. When you've said it when you've got kids and you're it's there fucking home. Yeah. Full stop. Get your own gaff. Because if you if if it, if it all goes bad yeah. and I'm not being funny, you can look statistically now, fucking it's like fucking ninety percent go bad now. Yeah. So it's not me being a miserable get. Mm. Do you understand? Yeah. If it goes bad, you're left with nothing. Yeah. Someone's left with nothing. Yeah, yeah. And then that, that, on the hairs of the emotional yeah, turmoil, that, that. you've then got a financial, you've then got Then you've got financial hair. And, and that's where it becomes, and that's where, and it, that's it, where it becomes back. twisted, bitter, yeah, yeah. fucking nasty, mm. angry. Mm. Do you understand? Come on, yeah. I'm, just, I'm just turning these eggs off, mate. No worries, I'll take your time out of the little chat to come here. So I'm just putting the ciggy out, I'm conscious I'm smoking on the camera, and I want to smoke on camera because I've chatted on here, I'm quitting bifters, fucking chatting. Yeah. Done three weeks the other month and it was fucking liberating. And then I was speak to Carl, fucking thought I could have a cigar at night, nuts. I could have a nice cigars at night. And that, no one know what the cigars was. I was thinking it was my granddad. I was sitting as a little fucking six year old with my granddad in the back garden looking at the fucking. It was always a nice night. Nice. Yeah. The moon was out, the stars were out. And slowly. I'm not asked, I have fucking said and quit. <laughs> I'm saying, that's why I'm bringing the thing. Go on. I want to talk about the insanity because I've lent on smoking, which I always have done. We all do, mate. Yeah. But to the, come off smoking the, was the Come off the hell. hard drugs. Yeah, yeah. but it's insane. Now I'm on it, my insane behaviour is like now it's all crutching on the cigarettes. They will kill me before any drug. I know, I bro. I do it myself. Mad, I crutch on them. Yeah. All smokers crutch yeah. on them. One if I go out, one if I come yeah. in, one if I'm hungry. Gonna walk the mess. dog, gonna go in the car, yeah. but build a city before. If I go it. in the toilet or if I be in the toilet. Yeah, anything. Yeah. We're all in the same boat. Yeah, and sanity. I'm swear. Where watch this space, you fuckers. <laughs> <laughs> They've been watching and not just fucking out. I've been watching for a year and nothing's happened. I've parked it for a year. Oh, yeah, all right, two years then, not It's right now, it's coming. It's coming. The power of the programme, the bifters can fuck off. Yeah. Um, right, uh, no, I won't labour that. It's horrible, the smoking. It's the worst, mate. Ah, Paulie does it to me. Ah, yeah. Paulie says it all the time to yeah. me. 
stop smoking. You know, you'll die. It's fucking horrific shit. Yeah, and the vapes, I'm not that. So we can have I don't want to swap to a vape. I'm not going to swap to a vape. On holiday, I had. I, I, um, I met some girl. I was yeah. fucking gabbing with her. She had a vape. And I had no ciggies with me. Yeah. And I ended up having to go with her vape. And in the hour or so, until someone come past with ciggies, I was smoking air vape. Yeah. And I thought I could smoke a yeah. vape. And then I thought, wow, put that down now, because we're rolling, mate. <laughs> so one on the next table, I was piling my back, like, pile back. I was like, get a rolling, mate. Like, yeah, no props. <laughs> like, I'm mad. not going from that yeah, yeah. to a fucking vape. Well, where, where, where does all the shit with the smoking now, which you've known for, for decades? That'll but, happen to that. Yeah, yeah. But I'm going into the shop. It's like an adult sweet shop when you go to the vape shops. I know. Man, get your fucking rock. <laughs> Listen, we don't. I don't rock that way. Like. Right, um, it's your nah, fucking ears. You're like a monkey. <laughs> you're Sit on my leg. Yeah, how is your fringe? That's what we like. What is your nickname in Thailand? Yeah, man. What was it again? Monkey. Yeah, man. Monkey, monkey boy. Right, okay. yeah, man. No, it wasn't. It was butterfly. Uh, yeah, I had a few, didn't I? Yeah. You did get called the monkey boy. Yeah, um, so how's your fringe going, lad? Let's just put it straight. Fucked, isn't it? Can you show your egg to the camera? No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's got a like comb over it, I'm gonna make sure. Fucking... It's bad, that can flap. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, have, I have front flaps. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be like that for half Do you know how I'll push it forward? Yeah. I should not, I might start put just pushing it forward, yeah. have a little fringe, because it. it and that's that, that's the neck because I don't know. I used to it's do terrible. that. I went to that, but don't you get the wrong air cut, you end up with that, mate. So that's what you're playing with, and you're playing. Pay I watched one of them on YouTube the other day, like <laughs> fella in the hood, and um, no way the hairdresser's film funny shit, right? And he's wearing really like he's like he's a kid, whatever, right? And he's shaving around his head and all that, but he takes his he takes his hairline from there. And goes <laughs> right back to there, right? And the fella fucking at the end, they're all laughing. The fella gets up, fucking smashes the window, takes his top off, starts fucking jumping round, and all he's ready to fight. <laughs> he's the mate. But he's like, you've took it too far. I was talking about that the other day. Where was that? No, the brows, the eyebrows. Talking yeah. about getting your eyebrows, which remember the anger when you'd wake up. Yeah, man. Fucking heavy shit. I wonder if that still goes on. It's of course it does. Do I seen the other day, and I won't go. I won't go like deep into what he was chatting. He's had a rough one. Remember that lad you got the earmark of Coppel? Oh, remember you were like sixteen, you know, like Coppel fucking him. He had a big, big fanny pass, and I looked all the side. It was, it was like the step up from yeah. the eyebrows. Seen him the other day. Couldn't remember his name now, that's the fourth thing. But uh, yeah, oh, that fucking day. That my eyebrows, look at my eyebrows now, there's part like my jeans. He was just someone said to me the other day, I didn't have a hair on my head. I just said, did you see two fucking big eyebrows? Have you got long eyebrows? No. You can't even grow eyebrows, you're a fucking Well, head. sometimes they shave them. Oh, do you? Yeah, I've, I've had them shaved, but not for all, because I've been young. Sweet, no. Do we know who's that sometimes? <laughs> have you seen them where they put the like wax up and fucking the punk them down? Yeah. Have you had a go at that? I've never heard that. Where would you get that from? Yeah, it's just like yeah, there was places in, anywhere really take as part of us do it. Really? It's not much extra, it's like a quiz for all the for all your bits though, on top of your haircut. Have you had that have you had one of them steam shaves? No. They're good. I haven't got much of steam, mate. No. <laughs> Oh, and what else did I Yeah, this room, it's like the page I'm on now. And that's the message I want to carry, like early recovery. And you used to say, I'd be like reaching out to one to be me, everyone's me. You know what, you know what else, Scott? Like, I've, because of, in my hometown, there's a, there's a recovery community now. There's no two ways, or everyone will look at it. It has developed, hasn't it? Yeah, yeah, which is good. But it puts a dimension on recovery. You know, when you've, 
used with people or scored off relations or brothers of slept with girlfriends and there's like a dimension which went on floating around Preston and Blackburn. You don't have. Yeah, so I'm in this hair and this hat. Hey, everyone, let's all get along. Yeah, and you like the anonymity. You like the anonymity. 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 Yeah, but you know when like, there's people not going for coffees and I'm like, well, why isn't everyone being mates? Because there's a whole world of fucking debauchery yeah. that I'm like, who blows, eh? You know yeah. what I mean? Mm -hmm. But the, basically, the, the point of that story was so, when I'm reaching out to everyone, I'm now cutting it down. There's four people in my life, you are one of them. They all watch this channel that, like, I'm concentrating. I've got my kids, I'm do, still doing it there, me hooking for the company. I'm still they I'm at a page with them now where I'm not trying to control them, just being present with them for an hour is priceless. Yeah. I'd have one pre present for one hour. Then like a week worth of the old, you know what I mean? Uh, yeah. Like we just had a Chinese the other night. Well, they fucking made a fucking mess, didn't eat at all. Only cost 30 quid. And it felt like I'd never done that, and I hadn't. I'd yeah, never been yeah. present. We were all older. We've all been through the tough times. And it was just a moment in time. Yeah. Like me off, yeah. And um, I forgot the point of that. So like, um, yeah, so now I'm no longer asked. I'm not, I'm not going to be rude, you know me. I won't be rude or obnoxious to anyone. I've got housemates. I've got seven housemates. That are yeah, but it's, it, it boils back to that, Nick's where self-preservation has got to come first. Yeah, yeah. You can, it's like anything, isn't it? If, if, you don't, if you don't look after yourself. Sorry, mate, it's a bit of heavy for you. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure that's that's <laughs> Uh, if you don't look after yourself, right, this is the number one fucking rule it's for anything. If you don't look after yourself, then you can't look after no one else. Yeah, yeah. And that's as simple as that. <coughs> yeah, yeah. You can, but you'll go into the ground and then you won't be able to, you won't be there to look yeah, after. Yeah, the face mask. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. You have. You, you've got to. You've got to fucking, you've got to look after yourself first. If you go, if you want to be able to help your fucking kids or anyone, yeah, yeah. you've got to look after yourself yeah. first. And it's mad to him. Um, you are too happy to help. Yeah, happy to help. Which, Which yeah, yeah but what it. it leads to, it leads to no help. Yeah, it needs to crash. Because you want to you help a thousand fucking people. Yeah. And by doing that, you don't help anybody. Yeah, and don't you end up letting them down. Yeah, yeah, and certainly don't help yourself. You end up letting them down. Yeah, yeah. Which then causes you fucking stress and anxiety yeah. and all that. Yeah, yeah, man. So that, that's like, the, that was only last night, you know what I mean? A profound, like, I'm getting profound moments now. That, like, wow, you know, where I, my, my thoughts, my natural, like, left unchecked. I was bang to right at the moment, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's yeah. quite... It's weird, it's not like, I'm not like over-egging it because of the work I've done with 12 steps, with like walking the line, with leaving scat, all this pain stuff that I've come out the other side that I'm not worried of, but now I can process it with the steps of like the programme. Yeah. But um, yeah, I could just, when I'm wrong, and I was wrong from like my whole memory, I can, and it's like a point where now as I'm going forward throughout my day, I can see where I'd be going, oh, I'll do that. Oh, why don't you want that? Oh, do you want to learn that tenor? And now the four comes in, but that pause which you got in early recovery, just that pause. So that pause where it just stop and like be like be like a rabbit in the headlights. Now in that pause, all kinds of magical fucking stuff's happening. It started with a pause and it like leads on to step nine, like intuition. And now I'm not, I'm, I could say that, but I won't, because I know, I don't exactly know why, but I know I'll end up to pain down there. It's fucking, because normally I didn't want anyone to feel pain. I didn't want you to, like, if I could see you were struggling, I'd put my cape on and, like, give you some fucking shoes, you know what I mean, to make you feel good. But I'd overextend myself. Give you money, I'd give you bifters. You fucking never give me fucking <laughs> fat <laughs> uh, I'm not fat. I'm not I'm fat. Not fat. <laughs> <laughs> we covered that. <laughs> that is right. No, it's just mad. It's quite profound the, the lessons I'm getting now. Listen, let's finish up with a quick fucking Go on. Tyson Fury, Alexander Ivesek. Come on then. Go on. Who do you think's going to win? 
That's all yeah. you need to do. Give your prediction, your fucking. I want, I want Fiori to win. I want Fiori to win. Who do you think will win? Fiori. You think Fiori? In the first. Okay. I won't even ask you about the others because you fucking don't even know. Do you? Well, you I'll, I'll, no, I'll let God decide. No, 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 no. Um, yeah, that's it. Fucking uh, good little chat, man. Yeah, man, it is right. Well, see you later, guys. I've got another one coming on later. I'm sorting it out, so I'll upload this now. And it should be in one before I get to bed. I'll go to our belt at unit. See you later. Peace out. Peace out, brothers.